yeah, so I came up with this idea to repurpose old telephone hardware um, in an attempt to save the the familiar red telephone boxes we all know and love. Yeah, I know. I know. And if we could offer free calls for people who really need, really need those um, those those lifelines, we can offer channels into various helplines and services for free as well. I know. And I've got a chat bot that we can train and we could we could um, help it manage the system um, as sort of an operator. Yeah, we'll have a we'll have an AI operator, which would be really cool. Yeah. Oh, cool. Yeah, that's a good idea. We could get artists to come in as well. Artists on different uh, available lines. So um, members of the public can contribute to community, com community thoughts and feelings about matters going on um, in the local area. I love it. Um, have, I, have I got something to show you? Um, please hold caller. This is the first test of the community payphone OS. I'd like to test the mailbox facility and the operator facility. So let's do the uh, mailbox first. I've rigged up an external speaker so we can hear what is coming through the receiver. So mailbox, you dial two. Press button at a check for messages. Press button B to leave a message. Okay, so we're gonna leave a message. So it's B to leave a message. Enter the mailbox number to send your message to. So every mailbox is uh, ID'd. So I'm gonna leave a message for uh, ID number one, four, seven, eight. It'll be more secure later on. So B to confirm. Eight. Hello, this is a test voicemail message for the mailbox. Your message has been sent. Okay, so the person I'm sending that message to, all they'll need to do is uh, find a community uh, phone kiosk, uh, activate the mailbox facility again. Press button A to check for messages. Press button B to leave a message. And press A to check for enter messages. Enter your mailbox number to check for messages. So they'll enter their... Uh, mailbox id and obviously a password later on current messages hello this is a test voicemail message for the mailbox and there we go message delivered brilliant so we know that that is working at the minute the nice thing about this is that it has a built-in chatbot programmed by myself and it's trainable so we can train it to offer advice and support or just at the minute it's just a general uh, thing to talk to and uh, just have light-hearted uh, conversation so uh, let's let's give the operator a call so to activate the operator we currently dial number four connecting you to the operator hello what's your name please hi it's nice to talk okay um, what's your name the operator i like my name okay so i guess you have to be more uh more um yeah direct with your questions and how are you today i'm feeling happy that's great glad to hear it so we can have a general conversation with it um it can do a lot of other fun little things operator tell me a story why don't you trust me? He wrote before sending it to both of them. Interesting. It's able just to tap in and just grab a, an online resource of stories. And in this case, tell me a joke. I saw a documentary on how ships are kept together. Riveting. Brilliant. That's funny. If you say so. Okay, fair enough. So we can train it. We can train it. Um, to, to, to adopt certain uh, person, personalities or attitudes or, like I said, offer help and advice because eventually I want helplines on, on, this, on this community um, project. Uh, there are some nice little Easter eggs in, that, in there as well. It can hook into repeaters um, so it can listen to any amateur radio, ham radio transmission. So let's, let's give that a go. Operator, can you check the frequencies, please? Local 5, Echo 5, 
So it's just a nice little feature to scan the airwaves and uh, just listen in to uh, another little window on the world. Anyway, let's stop that before it gets uh, before it gets too noisy. So I think that's a successful test at the minute. I have lots of other features planned uh, for the various other options, but generally it's all right. It'd be nice to eventually integrate this into proper payphone hardware to make use of any retired sets that are out there. But in the meantime, we just have to make do with this virtual version I've made. So yeah, that concludes the test for today.